Hi guys, hello, hello, it's Dorothy Matakator. Welcome to my page. How are you guys? Um, happy Tuesday. We are here to do our monthly kit. So um, it's November, so we're doing our December drop-in little um, sign. <laughs> so if you haven't seen these yet, um, we've been doing these now since January. And um, next month will be the last one of this series, and then we'll start start something else. But um, every month we've had a different monthly um, seasonal um, little sign or an everyday one. So um, this this month it is based on December. So there is it's hard for you to see, and I have something going on with my finger now. Sorry. I broke my finger now. Um, anyways, so there is, it says December 25th. It has a star, some greenery, and then it has baby Jesus in a manger. So that's right here. And then the, the everyday one says, bless this home. And it has some greenery on the side. So we're going to make those today. And if you have not started this yet, it's not too late. But um, we, we aren't going to keep these on forever. So if you need to get caught up, um, we'll probably have these like um, two two months after we're all done and then that's it because um, we have some that we've cut and um, that are left over from each month but we are not going to cut them forever <laughs> so anyway so if you need to get caught up just start doing that now so that you don't miss out on certain months um, anyways guys let's get started with this if you're watching just say hello if you're coming back and watching the replay, just put hashtag replay so I know you're here. You know you're live if you see the red live button. If you don't see that, then you are on the replay. So thanks for being here, guys. Um, it is Tuesday. <laughs> I set up for my craft show today, so we're going to do this fairly quickly. And then I will be out the door. I have a few things to pack. I have to grab some transfers. I have my chalk paste in my, in my wagon already to take out. I don't leave my chalk paste in my trailer. It's too hot. Um, and my transfers, I needed in here because I was making kits. So um, those two things have to go out. And um, just so you know, they're the kit from yesterday, the one, um, the new kit that dropped yesterday, it has the acrylic. And um, there was a couple of choices. One of them has sold out already, but there's still two and they're great choices. So um, I just want to get my hands on that surface. I didn't order extras for you guys because you know what? Right now, I don't have the extra money to do that, honestly. And um, you just need to order those. If you want it, you need to grab it. Don't rely on me to always get extras because sometimes I just can't. Um, I try. I try. The ones that I really know are going to be super popular. I will. I didn't think this would be popular, but I guess it is because it already sold out on one. Um, my guess is they just didn't have as many transfers for that one, the Peace on Earth, or people just really love that one. They connected with that one. So it's hard to know because sometimes they're using up inventory that they have in the warehouse, and maybe they had like 500 of that one, and they have a 1,000 of each of the other ones. I don't know. It's, it's a mystery to us. <laughs> Anyways, um, let me see who's here. We'll get started really quickly. Um, good morning, guys. It is Tuesday morning. Good morning, Karen Ross. How are you? Hi, Deb, my sister. Hi, Doris, my sister. Good morning, guys. Um, hi, Carrie. Hi, Karen West. Hi, Sarah. Hi, Sandy. Good morning, Lori. Hi, Cheryl. Hi, Pam. How are you? Okay, guys, Um, if you are not a designer, I would love if you would sprinkle. And I know Facebook has just been really odd lately. It is not sending out um, notifications, so there's probably not going to be very many people. It's just been that way for a lot of people, um, people that are like big, big people, um, not me, but um, <laughs> their pages are way down. So it's okay, but if you're not a designer, I would love if you would sprinkle so that it gets out there. Hi, Vicki, how are you? And um, good morning, Pam. I think I already said that, but hey, we're going to do our little drop-in frame. And that is, um, this is for our, this is our November kit, and I'm finally getting to it. And there'll be a free little something that goes along with it. <laughs> so let me show you how these work if you don't know. Um, this just slides out. Sometimes you will need to kind of lift on that, but this this one, um, I think one of mine slides right out and one I have to kind of lift. So this was last month's every day. It said, life is fragile, handle with prayer. 
and then this part just comes apart so if you need the whole thing the whole kit and caboodle i have that available um i have posted all that it will um, auto post at 7 15 my time okay so this one i think i usually have to kind of nope that one's fine um sometimes i have to kind of lift it but there's our november one so you can just store these separately i have mine in a little drawer and then um I'm just going to set these to the side so we have lots of room and we're going to get started on making our um, kits here. So let me put you down to here. Hi, Debbie. See you soon. <laughs> I know. I have to do this first. Ah, now I go to the craft show to set up. Hi, Mary Lee. Hi, Melissa. Hi, Chris. How are you guys? Um, I think my camera might be a little crooked. Maybe. I don't know. Let me just um, go in and then... All right, so here's our December um, block. So it is November, so we're doing the one for next month. So here's our December 25th. And the colors we're going to use, I think we're going to use, um, I, I really want to do use Alizarin Crimson for the 25th in December. I just think that will look really nice. And then we'll, for our greenery, we're going to do light avocado. Um, the background is uh, milk chocolate watered down. So what we need to do is, um, I need to do a different color for the major. So I'm going to use cocoa for the major. And then my star is going to be antique gold. Oh, guess what? I need to have a color for, I think that the blanket, I should just do light buttermilk, but I need to get flesh, um, a flesh color. Where are you? Okay, here we go. Um, warm beige. Okay. So that's my colors on there. And then this one, bless this home. It's going to be really basic. So background is going to be my light buttermilk watered down. Hi, Kirsten. How are you? <laughs> waiting, to, waiting for your test to start. Oh, Tina. I hope everything goes well. So um, this one's really basic. I'm going to use aloe for this. And I'm going to use light buttermilk. And my background, I thought about using um, slate gray, but I'm choosing not to. I think I just want to have two colors on that. So um, the background is going to be brown um, but two colors on the word part um, so there we go let's take this off let's get our board up here and we will get going I know I love these okay I'm gonna have to make it smaller so you can see everything and my camera is a little bit crooked let me see if I can get it let me see if I can get it straightened out um, ba -ba -ba. how is everybody happy Tuesday I always go the wrong way Cause it's like the opposite it's like when you uh, back a trailer <laughs> you gotta go the opposite direction okay all right so let's do the boards first let's put the boards at the very top let's put the boards up there and then let's pick this up apart okay so here's our greenery oh guess what i forgot i forgot brushes <laughs> you guys do i have brushes in my drawer probably not oh okay so i probably i'm gonna have to run out if i don't have brushes that's so funny. Um, maybe, maybe there's some buried. <laughs> you guys. Um, oh, I'm finding a few. Okay, I might have enough. I might. We'll see. We will see if I have enough. I might have to run and grab a couple of brushes. I found some different type brushes, so maybe we'll just make do. Maybe. Isn't that funny? Okay, I think I think I'm good. <laughs> totally have I have all my brushes up. Um, in, in the kitchen area. Okay, so 25th of December. Let's put that here. That's going to be alizarin crimson. Okay, so let's put December right there. My star and the halo and the, um, the straw. Those are all going to be my yellow color, which is antique gold. And then this will be cocoa. And then this will be two colors. Okay, so that's that one. <laughs> this one's easy. Hi, Shelly. How are you? Oh, it's raining there um, in Kentucky. Um, same in Southern Ontario. I guess it's the, just the weather, huh? That time of year. Um, how is everybody? I'm Kathy getting your first rain snow mix in Wisconsin. Um, awesome. I love that. I love snow. <laughs> I just don't want to live in it. I love I love to see it. <laughs> bless this home okay so i'm going to do this all in light buttermilk i just want to have it easy peasy easy peasy guys okay i'm going to put myself in the corner darling go to the corner 
Blue the corner, Darlene. Um, let me try that. There we go. There we go. Hello. <laughs> so, um, who else hopped on? Okay. All right. Let's get started. Let's do the background first. Okay. So, I have watered down milk chocolate. I'm praying that's the color. <laughs> if it's not, it is It is today. Okay, so I just watered down the paint. I just put some water in here and I'm going to spread this really quickly and hopefully I have enough. If not, I'm gonna grab a little more. Um, I might need just a little bit more to finish that off. So the craft show I'm setting up for guys, this one is in La Mesa, California at the community center. If you are familiar with that area and you are here, if you're visiting, or if you are, um, you live in this area, come see us. If you haven't ever been to the show, you are missing out. It is a great show. Um, granted, the first day is super busy. I would suggest if you don't like crowds that you wait till the late afternoon on the first day or you come the second day in the late afternoon or on Saturday. Um, Saturday usually isn't as busy at all, but... Um, I'm going to tell you that the first day, plan to wait in line an hour, okay? It's just that way. People know that. <laughs> if they don't know that, then that's kind of a bummer. But really, honestly, um, Wednesday is always a crazy, crazy day. And Friday can be that way also. So don't come Thursday because we will be home having turkey. So um, Thursday, we're not there. Okay, so there's light. Um, no, there's milk chocolate watered down <laughs> okay so let's just keep going we're gonna use where's the palette dish Darlene you are not even prepared <laughs> you know why um I have okay so I'm by myself this week um Tara has this week off and it's a little crazy in my shop so I'm gonna tell you that my orders are out of control <laughs> My orders were just out of control yesterday because they build up on the weekend and I'm doing it all myself and it's a little crazy. So I think I can use the same brush for, for both these, but I want different colors. So light avocado for um, the one that is the December one. So light avocado. I'll get these cut tonight. So I have these posted. I'll go set up my craft show. You guys, if you want to order... I'll cut these tonight and get these in tomorrow's mail for you so that you can have them um, by Monday and you can start painting. Okay, so that's like avocado. I wanna do aloe for this one. So I'm just gonna use the same brush and it doesn't matter if the color is kind of mixed. It will be fine. <laughs> so, I am, so I'm on my own this week. Um, Tara has the, has the week off. She's home with the rest of the family and um, I am just trying to keep up. I'll be at my craft show most of the time. I'll be working. When I get home, I'll be doing orders. Um, I worked all day yesterday on wedding orders and picture frames and cutout orders. So I'm doing my best, <laughs> doing my best to do both jobs. So it's okay. It's okay. We can work it out. I just need somebody else here to help. And my granddaughter is out of town. Um, you know, it's like just that time of year. It's It gets busy. Okay, so that's aloe. All right. Now, December 25th, I want to be a lizard in crimson. And so I'm going to I'm gonna do this. Um, oh, yeah, Tina, watch the replay. Um, I'm going to put some in here. I do need to use palette dishes. I might have to get a couple other ones. It's just that way. <laughs> it's okay, though, guys. Um, here's this brush. Sometimes you just have to punt, and um, that way I don't have to go out. Um, I love this color. It's like a deep, deep red color. I'm going to try really hard to not get down inside any of the little grooves. If I do, I will, little holes, I'll clean that out. So try really hard not to make too much of a mess there. But I, lo I love the deep bur burgundy. It is like a deep, deep burgundy red color. You can use any color you want. Um, I what I use is not what you have to use. So if you like other colors, absolutely use them. Okay. So, um, just because I have one color doesn't mean you got to do the same. Uh, you might like something else. You might want your colors to be like buttermilk. So they stand out. Um, I just kind of want it to be, um, Christmassy red, even though it is about Jesus in the manger. 
I still want to bring a little bit of Christmas into it. And I think with the greenery, this is going to look really good. This is not the proper brush to use, but this is what I have in my drawer. <laughs> so, so what did you guys think about the new kit? The new kit with the acrylic. I know that a lot of the, a lot of my um, team ordered them. I saw orders, orders, orders going through. I always see, um, so I don't know if you guys know, but um, I can look in my back office and I can see, um, I can't see exactly what my team members ordered, but I'm guessing that a lot of them are ordering the new kit, which I think it looks fabulous. I, I have worked with acrylic. It's not, I'm going to tell you that it can be, be a challenge and they say that it's reusable, but it scratches easily. So you just have to be careful about that. Um, it will scratch when you're trying to clean it. So you have to be careful when you're cleaning it. Hi, Sarah. How are you? We're doing the monthly kit. Okay, so let's see what's next. These are all going to be just light buttermilk. I could do that. And what else? Oh, the blankets can be light buttermilk. We could do that. So there's not a lot of colors on here, and it's actually going to go really fast. The, the longest part is going to be um, gluing it, honestly. <laughs> so who's going away for Thanksgiving? Who is going away for Thanksgiving? We are not. We are just here and going to have a very, very quiet Thanksgiving um, yeah, it's going to be super duper quiet. My daughter is away. I'm going to, I'll go back and I'll do the face part. Um, my, my daughter and her family are away to Prescott. So they're having their Thanksgiving over there with my, my granddaughter went also. And, um, my youngest son, of course they moved to Arizona. Wesley is right around the block, but, um, probably will not be joining us. I <laughs> will not be joining us. Um, his family is sick, so um, they will be. We'll be taking. We'll be taking some turkey and stuff up there, but it's just going to be John and I. It's just and the and the dogs. We're going to have very very quiet Thanksgiving. <laughs> yep, yeah, this year is going to be a lot different. Um, but John said he's still going to cook everything. So hi hi Janine, how are you? Happy happy Tuesday. <laughs> So this is the monthly kit that I'm doing. This is, um, I have the every day right here is bless this home. And then um, December 25th with baby Jesus. That is the the seasonal one. And that, you know, my nails keep breaking. It's that time of year. Do you guys get that too? I, I have little cuts on my fingers and I, and my nails keep breaking. I think it's from the dryness. <laughs> Everything is so dry with the heater on. Can you make it smaller to see the bottom? Oh, I, yeah, I can. Um, here's the bottom. There's the bottom. Perfect. Thank you for, thank you for letting me know. Sometimes I don't realize, sometimes I don't look up and see, and sometimes on the, on your phone or your computer, it's a little different too. So I can actually just scooch that up too. There we go. There we go. You have to cook um, Thanksgiving for 32 people. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's a lot. <laughs> Quiet one here, but everyone requested two or three different foods each. Oh, that's a lot of cooking. Yeah, for sure. What's your favorite dish guys? Um, I'll tell you mine. <laughs> I actually have two and my, hu my husband is really, really nice to do this for me because I mean, I have food allergies, so I can't eat the regular stuff. I can't have stuffing. I can't have turkey. Yeah, that's, I can't have the ham. <laughs> I can't, can't have the rolls or the green bean casserole. Yeah, it's not, it's not fun. But, um, what I can have is he makes prime rib for me. So he makes prime rib. Okay, so I think I can do this um, without putting it in the palette dish. Okay, so cocoa, and I might need another another brush. Maybe we can share. Maybe the brush. Oh, these are all going to be yellow. I think we're actually perfect. Okay, so cocoa, and then I'll get a small brush for um, the face. So he makes um, prime rib for me, and then also you know the yummy potatoes that they have that have sour cream and cheese. He makes those for me. Um, without the sour cream and which I'm not sure if I'm allergic to, I just haven't tried. So, um, he makes those and what I do is I put green chilies. So I put green chilies and cheese in the potatoes and they're really yummy. So I get my own little casserole of that to last me for a whole week. 
and then I have the the prime rib that will last for a long time so that's and he does the prime rib with just mustard salt and pepper and onions on it so I'm trying to get that corner <laughs> just that little corner there we go all right and I'm not going to do a second coat on those I kind of like it the way it is um, let me just scooch it over. I just missed the corners, though, on some of them. Let me just get the corners. So that's my favorite. Um, you're doing a Friendsgiving on Thursday and Saturday and family on Saturday. Nice, nice. Um, Friendsgiving. I love that idea. Love that idea. I am so busy with my um, craft show. I guess I am doing a second coat. Here we go. <laughs> that it's hard to do extra stuff because I'm right back at it. I'm Thursday. Thursday, I'm right back at the craft show, and then, um, I'm sorry, Friday, Friday, Friday and Saturday, right back at the craft show, so we have to do our thing on Thanksgiving, and, um, yeah, but, okay, so, you know, I've always said that I want to, um, go to the Macy Day Parade, which is on Thanksgiving, which is difficult, because doing craft shows, I'm always, I always have to be here, but I mentioned that to a friend, she goes, let's go. And what we'll do is we'll go, and this is my same friend, I think I told you yesterday, my same friend that um, went to the Dominican Republic with me, Cindy, she said, what we'll do is we'll go, we'll fly out um, Wednesday night, we'll catch the red eye to New York to be there in time and um, get check into our hotel and, and be able to be there for the parade Thursday morning because we're at our craft show Wednesday night. And then um, we'll catch the red eye home on Thursday to be back for the craft show on Friday. Both of us are very committed to that craft show. Um, we've both been doing that craft show for many years. And if you miss, then you lose your spot. So we're not going to lose our spot. And we also have to be there to help out with the craft show. So we got to figure it out, though. I mean, I think that's what we're going to do. We, I don't know if we're going to do it next year or the year after. But, hey, doesn't that sound like so much fun? <laughs> I don't know how, how much it costs to have a hotel room um, on the parade route, but I'm going to find out. I'll find out soon. Okay, let me get a little tiny brush for um, Baby Jesus' face, and then we are done with our painting. And then I'll have to decide if I'm going to ink anything. I don't know if I need to ink anything or not. Um, I really don't think so. I think maybe the manger um, and everything else I think is going to be fine. I don't think I need to ink it. Um, but, okay, so let's put just a tiny bit of our warm beige anyone going out of town going leave leaving um town come on you can do it i know you have a little bit of a little bit left in you i just know it come on just a little bit please <laughs> there we go <laughs> there we go all right guys here we are so this is for his face so we do baby jesus's face and we're not doing any facial features or anything like that. Okay, I'm gonna dry and then we'll glue together. It is time to glue together. And um, let's see, yep, everything looks good. I can, I'll stand up and see. Paintbrush is up there. I'll stand up and I'll check it out, make sure everything is covered and we'll get everything dry. Get my palette dish off of there. These look dry. Sometimes they're not. Sometimes it just looks like it is. So these, are, these uh, let's see, they'll post in 15 minutes. All right, so they'll post here on this page, also on my VIP page. And when you order through here, you'll get a little extra kit. Just a little something. Sometimes it's seasonal, sometimes it's just something else. All right, these are still kind of damp. So I really want these to be all the way dry before we glue the stuff onto them. So I'm gonna dry a lot more to make sure it's 100% dry. <laughs> Okay, now it's feeling dry. Okay, and this looks good. Everything looks good. That letter right there, you just need to do the side because there's paint on the side. Sometimes, sometimes I make a big mess. Sometimes. 
Okay, I think it's time to glue together. So the, this one's actually really simple. So first what I'll do is um, I'll lay it onto the boards and then we'll move the boards down. I'm gonna look and make sure that I don't have anything on the back so I don't mess up my board because it's it would be hard to fix that because it is a wash on the board. So really is not fixable. <laughs> I would have to paint the whole board. Okay, so there's that one. Look how nice that looks. I. I was wanting just two colors. I want it to be very, really basic. Cheesy potatoes are your favorite. Yes. <laughs> oh, Sarah. Um, let's see. Sarah says, 32 at your house Thursday. I live in that old house. So you just like packing them in. Oh, how fun. Fun. Um, that is, that's awesome. Yes, Cheryl. Funeral potatoes. <laughs> yes, we do call them them. When you're from Idaho, you call them funeral potatoes. For sure. <laughs> Because they're easy to make for, for funerals in big batches, especially in Idaho, because uh, with an abundance of potatoes there. So it was it was a very common dish when I was growing up. And you put bacon in there, sour cream, cheese. Sometimes people put other things. Um, I, I can't think of anything else. You know what? I don't think I'm going to ink this at this. I think I'm going to leave it. I think it's going to be fine. I think I think. Okay, and then I'm just checking the back. <laughs> Making sure that I'm not gonna make any mistakes. The star is a little, so you can see the scoring, right? So so the scoring is there for you, so you can see exactly where it needs to be. That's why we kind of do a wash on there so that you can see through it. Okay, those two are done. Let's get rid of this board. And then let's glue this puppy together and we are done with this. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Yeah, I have I have quite a long day of setting up. Um, I have probably eight hours of setup today. It's a crazy one because I, I am doing my chalk and tour stuff at this craft show. So it will be a long, long day, but it will be well worth it. <laughs> so I'll have my kits, anything that I didn't, um, there I had some kits that I offered for sale. So the extras will go to the craft show and I have lots of transfers, chalk paste. <laughs> Sadly, my display for my chalk, chalk paste, um, I'm gonna have to change it. It's okay, it's all right. We'll figure it out. We're gonna punt. We are going to punt because it is, and I might just bring my cordless drill so I can fix it. Um, it kind of got destroyed. It just kind of, something got, something got put on top of it in my trailer. <laughs> and that's not unusual for that to happen. Things shift as you're driving. And um, yeah, that's exactly what happened. There was there were other items that were by it that jumped on top of it. Yep, it happens when you're when you have a trailer and everything inside is not tied down because you have stuff on the shelves that is secured, but then the stuff in the center is stacked. And what happened was um, some of the stuff in the center um, shifted and got on top of my little display and it is like squashed flat <laughs> oh well you know it kind of was leaning the last time that I used it I I was going to need to repair it soon um, well I think it's not repairable but I might try might take a, a cordless drill with me and try to fix it <laughs> cordless drill and a handful of screws right um yeah, that usually, that usually is a great combination, right? <laughs> oh my goodness, guys. Okay, so just trying to put a little bit of glue. Um, it will take a little bit of time for this to dry. I'll see if I can actually put it in or not without having everything move. But I love this. I love just the two colors like that. Bless this home. This is our everyday one. So I try to do either something inspirational, something family, um, something kitchen. Um, I have a ton of coffee ones, but not everybody likes coffee, so I have to stay away from that. <laughs> Although I'm so tempted to do it, because you know, I think in the I think in the spring, um, we will do some some coffee signs. I have a ton of really cute ones, and you know me, you know me and my coffee. Gotta love it. Got to love it. All right, so there's that one. What do you think? I think that's super cute. I love that one. Picking up your daughter from college today. Oh, nice. Nice. You're going to try a turkey tenderloin in the air fryer. Ooh, that sounds really good. Um, 
Deb, ha have a friend and her son coming for Thanksgiving. This is the first year in more than 10 years that Eric will be home. Oh, nice. And yes, that's great. That is awesome. He'll be home. Um, the T is, is spaced further apart. Um, yes, it is. Um, let me fix that. There we go. Thank you. Sometimes. Sometimes. There we go. Okay, perfect. Thank you. <laughs> I need all the help I can get, honestly. Just tell me. Just tell me what to do. <laughs> I need all the help. Every bit of it. So, sometimes. Sometimes you're right there and you just don't see it. Yuppers, oh my goodness. So I, yesterday was such a combination of things. So I had all my paperwork for bookkeeping, had a ton of that. I had my orders, <laughs> I had wedding orders, I had picture frame orders, more picture frame orders than I've ever had the whole time that we've had the business. Um, I don't know what happened, but I had to order cases. I had to order more cases because I, I will be completely out of them today of what I have in inventory. I thought I had enough to last me all week. Um, but I, I engraved so many picture frames yesterday that, um, they're gone. They're gone. So, um, I have another order coming in today while I'm gone. So it's kind of nice. They will just leave it here for me. <laughs> they will just leave it here. Um, yeah, I, I don't think I have to sign for it. I'm hoping. I'm hoping I, I'm going to put a note. I'm going to put a note and just say, delivery men, please leave packages on, on the porch. And if you have any questions, call this number. So that's what I'll do because I can't be here and Tara, Tara's not working this week. So it is what it is, <laughs> but they need to leave it because I need it. Most of my delivery guys that are um, my, my regulars, they just know. They know that I'm going to be busy in the back, and the dogs will bark and bark. And usually the, the dogs are what, they, they're my doorbell, because I took out my doorbell, because I was I'm like, I don't want to talk to people. <laughs> I took out my doorbell when we remodeled, when we redid the front of the house, um, when, we, when we did the roof and all of that stuff, and redid all the stucco. Um, around the door area. I just, I didn't, we did not put back in a doorbell. We chose to not have a doorbell because sometimes you just don't want to talk to people, right? So <laughs> my dogs are my doorbell. Yeah. Okay. All right. So here's baby Jesus. And I'll look at comments here in a second. Um, oh, no more comments. Okay. If you guys have questions, let me know. Um, these will post in five minutes. I'm ahead of schedule. How about that? <laughs> These will post here on this page in five minutes and on the VIP page. And I'll cut them tonight. I'll get them mailed out um, so that hopefully you'll get them like by Monday. That would be nice, right? And you can start working on them. For These are for next month. So I'd like you guys to have a little bit of time. Sure, it would have been nice to have it for Thanksgiving, but Darlene just hasn't. I haven't been here. <laughs> I'm doing the best that I can. Okay, I really like that one. I am, I'm really glad that I chose to do the deep burgundy. Look at that. That is awesome. Now, if you want to ink it, you can totally do that. It would, it would change it up. So inking just helps give a little dimension, but you know what? It doesn't, you don't have to. So I didn't ink anything on these. <laughs> okay, let's kind of slide these in. Let's see if I can do that without messing anything up. Um, a lot of times I can, I just, I just lift this up and slide and slide and slide. Okay. That one's fine. The other one I think is a little bit looser. So, um, let me just push that down. Okay. So, oh, look at that. Look at, look at that. That looks really good. I like that. All right. Let me get the base. So then it just slides into the base. There's this little part at the bottom. There is a video showing you how to put this together. If you are new and you need to order this, there is a video that shows you how, how to put this all this whole thing together. I'll put this here so that when I go to myself, it can show you that. Okay, here's the other one. And I should, if it starts moving, then I'm gonna just wait, but it should slide in. I think this one's a little bit looser. So I'm just gonna lift this up a little bit and slide and slide and slide. 
and it is sliding a little bit. Okay, I think we're gonna be okay though. I think we can do it and I will just move everything back. Yeah, my my D is going out of place. Come on, let me get everything down. <laughs> I have to push it. It's it's like, it's not, it's not stuck. It's just like, it's hanging out there. Okay, let me try to get it over. Sorry, that was a little loud. I'm gonna have to adjust it once once we get um, once it dries. I think I can slide it a little bit. Really, you guys, just wait. Just be patient. I just wanted to show you guys. Okay, I'm gonna slide it to the side. Maybe. <laughs> no, right now it's not gonna slide to the side. It it wants to, it wants to just be where it wants to be. So let me see. Oh, there we go. There we go. I broke it loose. Okay. All right, we got this. We got this, guys. So I don't suggest doing that, but I wanted to show you guys how it looks. And it looks fabulous in there. I'm going to clean up some of my glue that's in the center there. I'm going to make sure I got everything lined up still because some of it did move a little bit. But everything looks really good. Okay, let me put it into the base. And then I'll put you to myself. So it goes like this. So, so this part, um, it kind of leans a little bit back. One of them leans a little bit more than the other, um, but let me just put you to myself. There we go. All right, what do you think, guys? I think these are super duper cute. I love them. There we go. <laughs> I love both of them. And like I said, you don't have to shade. I didn't do any shading on these. I, I love the simplicity of this one. I'm like reaching for the wrong one. I love the simplicity of that one. Bless this home. All right. Okay, guys, I got to go. I have to pack the rest of my truck and I have my breakfast sitting out there um, ready for me to make sure I grab that. <laughs> okay, tomorrow is Wednesday and I do have to work at the craft show, but I don't have to be there till nine. So I will be here for you guys in the morning. Alrighty, love you guys. Have a wonderful day. Um, we are getting ready for turkey day. Yes, we are. All right, love you guys.